Aspiring independent presidential candidate Marashok is infuriated over the current shuffle between political parties in the country as they gear up ahead of the December presidential election. The Gambia has seen public confrontations and point scoring from the country's most senior politicians who are busy playing blame games with the aim of convincing people to vote for them. The former businesswoman declared her candidacy last year to run as an independent presidential candidate in the December polls, hoping that a coalition will be formed by political parties to have her lead them. Sok said, no more grumbling about everything that is wrong in the country and what is wrong with its leaders. We need to change and we will change. The blame game, the name calling, the point scoring and the finger pointing None of this will push our country to the heights it is destined to reach. Soko was addressing the nation in a speech that was streamed on social media. She had recently visited several villages in the country, engaging them as he drums up support for a possible coalition to challenge President Adam Abaru. Political pundits forecasted a possible coalition between President Barrow's NPP and other political parties to secure Barrow a second term in office. The elections may be a clash of alliances. Although Sok is dismayed by the negative politics, she has not indicated which parties are her likely allies in her bid to become the country's first female president. Mary Sok is the second woman to seek the presidency. President Barrow's NPP and rights attorney Usainu Dabo's UDP are the country's biggest political parties, making them arch rivals who are busy purging support from other political parties to secure them a win on December 4th.